Welcome to Ellerslie 2014. The gates are just about to open and well two days from now but today it's what we like to call Mad Monday because today through the morning all the gardeners, all the designers are madly scrambling around getting their gardens and their designs fixed and looking perfect. They have to be off the site by midday. That means all of the rubbish that they've collected over the last week, all of the vehicles, everything has to be removed and then from midday onwards the gardens are absolutely in pristine condition and that's when the judging happens. So the judges walk around, make their judgments and those prizes, the medals are awarded first thing tomorrow morning. Mad Monday. Boy, it's been a couple of crazy days as well. Saturday we had one of the hottest days in Christchurch on record. And then yesterday we had a southerly with storms coming through. So these are just some of the things that the gardeners and designers have to attend with. So let's go around and catch up with a few and see how they're coping as we count down to that midday time. Yeah, it's been pretty full on, pretty late nights and um, there's 10, about 10,400 plants in here. So, um, so yeah, it's been pretty full on, but final touches and yeah. Pretty wrapped, got some awesome help this year, so yeah, we'll be finished uh, hopefully about an hour beforehand so I can just tinker up and water. That rain, oh flip, I was a bit stressed, I was, had to quickly cover it, rush down and buy something to protect it. Pretty stressful, but it's looking completed I think. Uh, the rain was really, well I thought it was really bad, but then um, at home we don't get huge hailstones like that, so I was kind of stood in it thinking, oh my god that really hurts, and then thought, oh no, the garden, and we had like net up and everything. So, um, but it was better than I thought this morning. I was expecting things to be flat, but they were, they were quite good. We managed to get all our stuff covered um, and all our plants covered so they didn't get hurt, but so it just sort of put a bit of a slowdown on the day. It couldn't get quite as much achieved, so we've got quite a bit to do before judging starts, but um, we're on track and going to get there. We're on track and, uh, yeah, looking forward to actually to be getting out of here and getting us some sleep. <laughs> The guys here have just done a, an amazing job, couldn't have done it without them, they've done some long days and so it's really as much about their efforts as, as anyone else's. Yeah, no, wonderful actually, we're well on track and uh, everything's looking really good, yeah, we're really pleased with how the, the whole thing's just sort of bedded into the into the site. Yesterday it was a mad panic, we were down here putting tarpaulins over everything but luckily it uh, wasn't quite as bad as, uh, as, as what they first predicted, um, so yeah, I think we came out of it quite well actually. Well, I think most people are nearly finished. It's just all the titivating bits and tidying up the bits of grass and making sure there's no dead leaves and no dead flowers. Well, I think Hort Galore's actually better this year. The ga I think there's a better range of plants in there and the groups that there have done really good displays and I think the judges will have a hard time. Well, it's been a long day, a long night and the guys have worked really, really hard. We've got our builder on site, he's working like a slave. Um, my wife's been working really hard. Our designer is brilliant. He's just going through there now, putting the final touches to the site, and I think we'll get there by midday. Well, they've all been working so hard for so many weeks, and now it's coming to an end. The climax of midday, the tools are down, the sites are cleared, everybody must leave. And then through the afternoon, that's when the judging happens, and the medals are awarded tomorrow morning. So we'll be following that and let you know the prize medal winning gardens as well. But I don't know about Mad Monday because as we've just seen, everyone's feeling pretty happy, so maybe we should call it Mellow Monday. But anyway, nonetheless, it's been a tough few days and lots of hard work have gone into making this Ellerslie the biggest and the best ever. So Wednesday morning, 10am, that's when the gates are open to the public and we'll look forward to seeing you for Ellerslie 2014.